what's up my peoples, I'm Go here, the freaking geek himself, and welcome to the Just Transform It video for Moon Studio Dark Knight. So without further ado, let's just transform it. So, to get him into train mode, I'm going to first pop open the chest, and flip his head in, and close that back up. Now we're going to work on the arms. You can bring this panel out. This will slide forward. Lift this panel up. Uh, you want to open up the form. Open it up all the way. So that way you can flip the hand in. It's a little tight, but it's doable. There we go. And then you want to compress the arm in using this double hinge. And then close it up. Then you're going to detach the arm from this little clip here and just kind of push it forward so you can bring this up and you have a tab that will go into the slot right in here. Just bring that up and that will tab in right there like that and then you can take the arm and just rotate it out at the shoulder like that. Then you're going to do the same thing on the other side, just bring that out. Slide that forward, bring this up, open up the form, swing that fist in, collapse the form, close that up, then detach, bring this around, swing this up, and tab that in, and rotate all of this down like that. Once you've done that, you can take the arms and bring them up like so so now for the backpack i'm going to just undo all of this undo the backpack itself you want to take the section here you want to pull it out and then swing it forward bring all of this up and you have uh, posts and ports and tabs and slots that will locate in the backpack here so you have all these posts and ports going on here. So just get everything in place. I find that it's better to actually get this back panel in place first. And then make sure you slide this back down. And get these, these little side panels in place first. And that will make getting everything else clipped in a little bit easier. And there you go. So once you've done that, you can take these panels here, just swing these out, swing these out. These panels will come down, and there's a tab that will go into this slot right here on the side. So, let's make sure get all that going. That will just tab in, make sure this little tab goes into this notch right there. Same thing on the other side. Get that tabbed in. Get that little bit tabbed in. And there you go. So now, with the wheels, what you're going to do here is you're going to, it helps if you just raise this up, flip the wheels up. Then you have a little tab right here that you're going to push up and that will keep the uh, wheels from collapsing back in even though it still doesn't really work that well but that's the intent we can bring that back down and uh, we're done for now with the back part we can leave this alone for now and now we can work on the legs so what you're doing with the legs is you're going to Gonna undo that panel, undo this panel, come back here, and undo this back panel here. You're going to bring the foot out on this double hinge here, just extend it all the way out, just kind of tilt it out to the side. You can flip this forward, take the toe, flip it back. You're gonna take this whole assembly here and just untab this on a double hinge. Just take it and swing it out. So that you can then take this panel here, 
and flip that out. And there's a little panel here that you just want to straighten out as well. Once you've done that, just open up this section and flip this section out and then bring the wheels down and then flip the wheels themselves up like that. They can close that up and that will sit like that. Once you've done that, you want to take this whole panel and shift it up like so. And then you want to shift the foot up on that double hinge and then rock that in. And that panel will tab in right here to the front. Like that. And they have that side done. Second verse is just like the first. So undo that. Undo that. Bring that foot out. That double hinge. Straight out. And just swing that up. So you can bring this out like so. Then open this up, bring this up, bring that wheel assembly down, bring the wheels themselves up, and close that up, close that up. There you go. Then again, just shift all of this to the upward position. Bring that down, put the foot back, rotate this up, and swing it all in. Slip out this little panel here. And just push all that in. Like that. Um, you also have the little tabs here to push up to Lock the wheels in on either side. Let's do that. Again, they're very small. There we go. Put those up like that. And then you're just going to take the two halves, tab it all together, make sure that these wheel sections here interlock. Like that. I'm just going to rotate this panel around. Make sure that stays together. Rotate this panel around. Can leave these panels up for now. So right here, you're going to Unfold this section here, bring it down, and it will tab into these, to, the, to these two slots on either side. So we have everything lined up here. There we go. That will tab in on either side, right there up top. Like that. And then you are going to peg these panels together. Again, it helps if you just kind of swing it in at an angle there. And these panels will peg together. And then all of this will interlock right here. I will also tab into the side of this roof panel here. So get all that lined up. Tab it in. There you go. And do the same thing on the other side. Again, I'm just gonna rock all this in. So you can tab these panels together. Oops. There you go. Just make sure you have all those hinges engaged in here. There we go. And get all that tabbed in. Now this side you want to kind of swing, you want to bend this hinge in so you can get that tab underneath that panel there. And then you can tab it in. Tab all that in. All that together. Like that. 
and then close those panels down. Oops, this came undone. Just make sure everything's tabbed together. And there you go. Oops. together and there you go there you have dark knights in train mode And now to get him into combined mode, we're going to pop these panels out. You can pop all these off, just you can kind of swing that out a little bit. So do the sides. Just get everything freed up. Something like that, so you can swing that out. Bring this up. You're going to come back here, you're going to remove this door, and it will plug in right up top here, like that. And once you've done that, you're going to bring this whole roof panel up, fold this in, and then you can close this back up. like so. So once you've done that, now we are going to uh, split this whole front section here and work on the legs. So again, you just want to kind of bring the foot out, just swing that out to get that out of the way. And what's going to happen here then you want to use these double hinges here just to kind of swing this, get this out of your way. Now you're going to flip this little tab down so you can flip the wheels in. And you're going to take the leg and you're going to bend it at the knee here. It's a little easier to do when you have things connected. There we go. Just bend the knee like that then you can open this up and then you are going to compress this in using a double hinge this is going to swing in like so and then you have a tab that will go into a slot right there to lock that in place bring that down bring the wheels down And then you can bring this up and just basically put all this back the way it was. You want to leave this panel up and there you have that side done. So you're going to do the same thing on the other side and just disengage all that. Just going to get it up and out of the way. Bring this out. Okay, I'm going to flip in a little, little retaining tab here. Put that in. And bend the leg. Like so. Then open this up. Then compress all of this in. Using the hinges. And close that up, close that up, and then just put everything back the way it was. 
and then connect the two halves together. Like that. Connect these wheel sections together. So, and there we go. A couple more things to do here. We want to again bring down these little retaining tabs here for the wheels. Put these back down so we can put the wheels back down. That fold that up, and this wheel section will just tab into the slot right here, like that. And then, last thing to do is come back here. We can put these panels back together and just fold that in, peg this all back together, fold that in, and everything will interlock. Like that. And one accessory to add, we bring in this section here. This will just tab in to the side of the foot. Against something that's on a hinge. There we go. Get this all back together. And there you go. There you have Dark Knights in combined mode. And to get him back into robot mode. Move that. And just undo everything we just did here. So we'll start off with the legs. Just split all this. Split all, split all. Open all this up. And just open all these panels here, open this, open this, extend that leg, back out on that double hinge, come on. <clears throat> Back up. Get the straighten the leg back out. Like so. And just open this up. And you want to flip this section here with the wheel in like that. And then flip all this in. And then close that up. Make sure it's sitting right there so it locks all that in place. Like that. Again, just take the foot. And just swing it out, extend it down on that double hinge, you can flip out the toe, flip that up, this little panel here, we'll flip back, unpeg all of this, and that will just swing up and around like so, these panels here, we'll flip in, sit there like that. Then you can collapse all this down. Close that panel up. Close this up. And you have a tab that will go into this slot right here. Get that in place. And then you just shift the foot back on that double hinge, like so. And there you have a leg 
all done. And you're gonna do the same thing on the other side. So just undo all of that, swing it out, just extend that foot out. You can flip this back now. Open all this up. Undo that, just untab that. So you can extend the leg out. Go. And just close that up. I find that closing it up just helps you to uh, straighten the leg back out. There we go. You can open that back up. And then just flip this wheel section up, flip that in, close that up. There you go. You can open up these panels here. Take that, rotate that around, swing that in, tab that in, and then just shift all of this down. Close that up, close this panel up from the leg, tab that panel in on the side, flip up the toe, flip this panel up, straight up the foot, and then shift it back, and there you have his legs all done. So now we move on to the upper body, untab all that, move that door, Put that back where it was. And then we just start untabbing these panels here. Just free those up. Let's untab all that. Just free that up. Bring this wheel section back up. These panels here will just swing in and swing in like that. And then just kind of give this backpack here, just kind of give it a little tug to help free things up. Just kind of undo it like that. And then you can just kind of grab in here and just kind of wiggle the arms out. And I find it helps to uh, undo all this. There you go. Just kind of pull, pull this panel up as you're kind of wiggling these out. And the arms should just come right out. Like so. And then you just pull this section out so you can swing it back and then slide it back in. You can collapse all this up. So I'll tap and slot connection right there. I should hold all that in place. You can bring that whole backpack down like so. And now we can work on the arms, so you just swing this up. Untab the forearm, bring it down, make sure it clips in to the back here. Like that. Open up the forearm, extend the arm. Again, open up that panel as far as it will go, so you can flip out the fist. And close it back up. Oh, I didn't have that straight, that's why. There we go. Put the panel down. This panel here will shift back. Tap that into the shoulder. And... Same thing on the other side. Just rotate that whole arm up. Untab. Straight it out. Tab it into the back there. Open up the forearm. Extend the arm. Flip up the fist. Close it all back up. the panel down, shift that back, bring that up, tab that in, 
Then open up the chest, flip out the head, close it up, and there you go. There you have Dark Knight back in robot mode.